In a D.C. courtroom as we speak, Capitol Police Officer Eugene Goodman is on the stand, testifying in the trial of a QAnon supporter who chased him around the Capitol on January 6th. I know you're going to remember some of these images, right? The officer being chased up a flight of stairs, essentially luring the insurrectionists away from where members of Congress had been hiding. The guy leading the charge there against Officer Goodman, Doug Jensen, who's now on trial. He's the one in the Q shirt with Jensen's attorney arguing in court. His client genuinely believed in the conspiracy theory and thought that the so-called storm had arrived on January 6th. NBC News justice reporter Ryan Riley is following this trial. And it's so interesting here, Ryan, because I, I think that is among the most familiar scenes from January 6th, that video shot by Igor Bobik of, of Officer Goodman coming up the stairs there. We haven't heard much from him publicly at all. What little we have heard comes from some court testimony. Talk to us about what we've heard so far. That's right. So a lot of people, of course, know about that video shot by our friend Igor. But what we're learning on the stand here, and we've learned in some court filings recently, is that Eugene Goodman has a whole story that preceded what exactly happened uh, in that video. He actually was outside, uh, and he was getting pepper. He was getting pepper spray. Got hit with bear spray outside of the Capitol uh, before all of this took place. He also was involved in an arrest. He actually put someone in a police van because he didn't have as much of a heavy of uniform as a lot of the other folks who had the harder gear um, when he went back out. Out there. He arrived at the Capitol on January 6th at 5 a.m., was supposed to be posted up in the rotunda as members of the House and Senate went back and forth as they are going through the certification process on January 6th. Obviously, all of that sort of got scrambled. Uh, he ended up taking this person into custody. He got, he got bear sprayed. And he described this moment where he's in the Capitol crypt after he gets bear sprayed, after he gets hit back with some of the pepper spray that uh, MPD officer.